Hi, this is Noma Dimitri. As 2016 is drawing to a close and about to leave us for good and forever, uh, it's time to reflect a little bit about some of the things that have happened during this year. This year, I think, will stay in the history of our own lives as a very polarizing year. Um, a year in which we felt more keenly the differences between us uh, as citizens um, than the similarities. Uh, this is best exemplified by the election results in the United States, of course, where for the first time, really, the distances between the different parties, or more likely, the distances between the people that voted for Trump and those that didn't, were stronger than any other time before, at least in my lifetime. Um, and that's only the span that I'm talking about, you know, the particular generation that we live in right now. Um, what is one to do as we look forward to a new year that hopefully will bring new things, but we're dreading that's going to bring more of the same? What can we hope for? Um, I think the only thing that I can think of is that we find ways to bridge our differences, and that means finding ways to explain to each other, those of us that have different opinions, of what our respective opinions are. I think this because of X, Y, and Z reasons. You think this because of A, B, C reasons. How can we understand each other's viewpoint? Um, the word for this, of course, is compassion, and I don't think we can have enough of that. So my wish for all of us for 2017 is more compassion and therefore more understanding and therefore an increased ability to see each other's viewpoints and somehow come a little bit closer, if not in agreement, at least in dialogue and conversation. Noma Dimitri, let's have a happy 2017, I hope. Bye.